Hello and welcome to this video on Understanding Divorce under the Hindu Marriage Act, 1955. In this video, we will discuss the various grounds on which a marriage can be dissolved for the Hindu couples. Ground 1. Adultery If the other party has voluntarily had sexual intercourse with any person other than his or her spouse after the marriage. Ground 2. Cruelty If the other spouse has treated the petitioner with physical or mental cruelty after the marriage. Ground 3. Desertion If the other spouse has deserted the petitioner for a continuous period of not less than two years immediately before filing of divorce petition. Ground 4. Conversion to another religion If the other party has ceased to be a Hindu by converting to another religion. Ground 5. Mental disorder If the other spouse has been incurably of unsound mind, or suffering from mental disorder to such an extent that the petitioner cannot live with the respondent. Ground 6. Leprosy If the other spouse has been suffering from a virulent and incurable form of leprosy, Ground 7. Venereal disease if the other spouse has been suffering from venereal disease in a communicable form. Ground 8. Renunciation of the world if the other spouse has renounced the world by entering any religious order, then the marriage can be dissolved on this ground. Ground 9. Not heard of for seven years if the other party has not been heard of as being alive for a period of seven years or more by those persons who would naturally have heard of it, had that party been alive, then the marriage can be dissolved on this ground. Ground 10. No resumption of cohabitation if there has been no resumption of cohabitation as between the parties to the marriage for a period of one year or upwards after the passing of a decree for judicial separation in a preceding to which they were parties. Ground 11. No restitution of conjugal rights If there has been no restitution of conjugal rights as between the parties to the marriage for a period of one year or upwards after the passing of a decree for restitution of conjugal rights in a proceeding to which they were parties. Thank you. Please like, share and subscribe.